Hello everyone. Here I will talk about a, a browser extension called Vimeon. If you like to use Vim and don't like to use mouse, this might be something for you. So here I will only talk about some of my favorite bindings and uh, maybe briefly mention about the other ones. So uh, you can see the, the uh, project is hosted on, on GitHub and has a lot of stars. Um, so you can go up and down and just like a normal Vim. Uh, so you can close the tab with X and reopen it with capital X. Um, one of my favorite thing is the short, shortcut for the links. For example, if I tap F, you see every link has a shortcut there. So if I want to go to the pull request, I just do AF and I'm there. You can go up and down using U and D. And if you want to go back in history, you can do capital H. If you want to go forward, a capital L. And go back forward in history. Um, yeah. Also, if you want to open a new uh, tab, you can do T, and then type the content. Uh, or you can, you can say um, capital O, which means open in a new new tab let's say we want to go to amazon and then suppose there are input boxes like here you can go there quickly just by gi and if there are multiple input boxes you can just do uh, you can just use tab to go between them apple okay we can also go back in history Okay, yeah, that's about the the main ones. Uh, you can also like go to the bottom, like G, capital G, go to the top uh, by GG. Uh, okay, uh, so if you want to get help, you can do question mark, and you will see all the bindings. But those are about the, the main ones I, I use every day. Uh, yeah, so at one point, I also uh, tried another plugin called uh, Surfing Keys. It has many bindings say, uh, uh, similar to Vim. I think it even has more bindings. One nice thing about it is it, it can open PDF and you still have Vim bindings on the PDF. Uh, one downside is that I think it's written in JavaScript and sometimes it will conflict with the JavaScript in the website and then the the web website parsing will be messed up. So in the end, I, I settled with Vimeon. Okay, I hope this is uh, useful for you. Thanks for watching.